hands are hands together for that wonderful spoken word. Let's celebrate the ministry gift of Kemi Adenaya. We can do better than that. Put your hands together. The Bible says the race is not to the sweet, nor the battle to the strong. Time and chance happen to them. Who put their stress, their rest, who put their hope in God? Put your hands together. As we just for the next five minutes for our Daniel session. <laughs> what a timely thing. In a time as ours, in times like this, where you cannot predict what happens tomorrow. In a time like this, where you don't know where the next hurricane or earthquake is going to take place. In times like this, when children, people are being mutilated and being beheaded. In times like this, when sickness is the order of the day, when financial difficulties, when we don't even know what tomorrow holds, what we need is ease, rest. Because we've seen so much. Can I have Isaiah 32 verse 18? This is the promise of God for us today. And we're just going to read that one prayer point. Because we just read our affirmation. He says, with the word that I speak, I become. I am word made. And you know who is the word? Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Isaiah 32 verse 18 says, My people will live in peaceful dwelling places. Amen. Yes. A lot of dwelling places are not safe. There is no rest. But this is the word of God for you and I. As we celebrate 2017 going for gold. It says, my people will live in peaceful dwelling places. In secured homes. Amen. In undisturbed places of rest. It means you, won't, you will no longer be disturbed again. Amen. Oh, that amen is too weak. The louder your amen, like Pastor Adiel should say, the louder your amen, the more you will live in the realm of peace. Yeah. I didn't put that word there. It says you will live in undisturbed places. It means sickness will be far from you. Financial difficulties will be far from you. But before you pray for yourself, beloved, I just want you to lift up your hands and praise the Bible says. Remember the theme, the scripture theme for this conference is 2 Chronicles 20. In 22, verse 22, it says, As they began to praise Him, hallelujah, as they began to praise Him effortlessly, God gave Jehoshaphat rest and peace effortlessly with ease. He fought his enemy. I want you to lift up your hands and just praise his name. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. In him we live, in him we move. In him we have our being. Hallelujah to the King of glory. Lord, we thank you. We honor you for such a time as this. Thank you for bringing us into the realm of ease. You have spoken, Lord. You said we will live in secure homes, in undisturbed places. Hallelujah, Lord. We thank you. We praise your name, Lord. We thank you, Jehovah. Blessed be your name, Lord. Blessed be your name, Lord. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Now, finally, I said one. Finally, I want you to say this after me. Father, in the name of Jesus. Because you live. I confess tomorrow. Because of the word you gave me. I will speak into my life today. No more brass for me. No ah, you are not getting me. No more brass. No From this going for gold, I will go for gold. From this year's going for gold conference, I will go for gold. I will no longer go for brass. Gold is mine. Rest is mine. From today, I will operate only in the realm of ease. Come 
come. Whatever I say to go shall go. Whatever I decree to come shall come. Rest in my home. Rest in my body. Rest in all that I do. Please come that to pray and just pray. Make that declaration in the name of Jesus. Rest is not good. Gold is what God desires for you and I. From this year is going for gold. Lord, I desire gold. Gold for me, gold for my husband, gold for my children. Rest in my body. Rest at home. Rest everywhere. In the name of Jesus. What I say, I become Lord. Lord, what I say, I become Lord. Because I know you as Him, as my healer. I know you as my Jehovah. I know you as my protector. I call you my shelter. I call you my refuge. I call you my everything. I call you my redeemer. I call you my savior. I call you my savior, my protector. In you, I live in you. I move in you. I have a fine being. Hallelujah, Lord. Glory be to your name, Lord. In Jesus' name, we have declared. As you have declared this, so shall it be. Whatsoever you say from today, everything positive, everything that is good, everything that is wonderful, shall be for you in the name of Jesus. They will come to pass in the name of Jesus. You will live in rest. You will walk in rest. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be. Nothing will change it in Jesus' name. Why we ask?